welcome to my first video. <laughs> um, on that note, I'm gonna show you guys five ways to pimp up your usual pup. Because, you know what, after a few years of the natural, a puff can come quite boring. Actually, a puff is really boring. <laughs> so, I'm gonna show you guys five ways that I pimp up my puff, you know, so that I don't look the same old, same old every single day and that I look a little cuter. Get ready. As you can see, I'm parting my hair with a small rectum comb. So just, you know, part it symmetrical. Do it better than me. <laughs> So I have these clip-ins, that just makes it easier to just hold your hair. And then we have a shoelace that I use to um, do my puff, and I use this for my usual puff. A shoelace or stockings, it's very easy to use any of these two things. You know, we always have stockings and shoelaces. So then I, you know, do what I do. So you take the two parts and then you twist your hair. Um, so you just go up and under. Um, I think the video just shows it. I think it's hard to explain twists. This is a slower clip whereby you can see that you know I go up and then under with the other part. So you hold your two parts and you go up and under, up and under. So yeah, that's pretty much it. I know some people find it hard to do twists, but it's really not that difficult. Just, you know, keep practicing. Practice makes perfect. You'll get there. Don't you worry. So now we're going to add some jewelry. Well, first I'm going to put some bobby pins. I think, you know. Almost everybody has bobby pins. If you don't get yourself a full packet, about 100 pieces, you need them. So here we have some jewelries that I add. You just open them and yeah, just put them in the way you want it. Whether you want one, two or three pieces, you put some at every side. This actually, you know, makes your style a little more simply because you add some gold jewelries to it. And it's pretty fun too. Um, so here I'm just, you know, choosing the right side. So with the second look, we're just gonna part our hair again and choose use some elastic bands preferably the one without metal because else your hair gets stuck and that could harm your hair and yeah so we make two parts um, and then we add the bobby pins again it's real easy real simple et voila you have your second look go ahead and look cute girl look cute so look Three, let go. Um, so it's actually handy to use a water spray bottle while you do your style. It's easier for you to part. It hurts a little less. Don't be, you know, having hair that's too dry. And it just makes it a ton easier. So we're parting our hair. This time we're parting to the side. Don't mind me. I just like my clips. Um, so we're going to use our shoelace, our stockings, whatever you have. You know, no need to buy something special to you know put our hair in a puff and we're going to braid okay i'm gonna try to explain braiding wish me luck so as you can see you put your hair in three parts um as you put your hair in three parts you just make sure one goes up the other one goes under and that's how you just switch it up the three parts so i'm gonna just let the video do the talking because I find it super weird to explain how to do a braid. And if you're better with twists, you just do the twist. Now we end the braid by twisting it. It makes it easier. You have less hair there, so that's why we're going to twist it. Mm -hmm. 
okay so eventually you add the jewelry again and you can see the two styles you can do with it so either you take a bobby pin and put it to the side or you know you leave it loose so for the fourth look i would advise that you either braided your hair before or put some twists in so you get that good stretch out there and so this time we're just going to leave our hair loose. We just put it to the side, don't do anything else with it, but look cute. I really like this look. Um, I started it recently and it's one of my favorites. Okay, so the fifth look is probably the easiest look. So all we're going to do is part our hair into two pieces, take an elastic band and just Instead of one puff, we're doing two puffs. It's pretty self-explanatory. Et voila, you just part your hair and then two puffs. That's pretty much it. Okay, that's it you guys those were five ways to pimp up your natural hairstyle your usual puff because as I said it gets quite boring sometimes so hopefully you like this video and comment down below let me know which one is your favorite don't forget to like Comment down below and subscribe to my YouTube channel. On that note, have a lovely day.